This is Sphere, a futuristic 112 meter high, 157 meter wide entertainment venue. Clad in 54,000 meter square of fully programmable 2K LED screens, it is the largest spherical structure in the world. Packed with new technologies in 3D audio, immersive 4D experiences, it could transform the entertainment industry. With a price tag of $2.3 billion and containing 17,500 seats, it is unlike anything anywhere else on Earth. It features the largest and highest resolution LED screen in the world, a gigantic 19,000 by 13,500 pixels. The inner screen wraps up over and behind the stage to give the audience a fully immersive experience. But the screen and the LEDs are hiding something much more innovative inside. Sphere has advanced, extremely precise audio capability. Using 1600 holoplot speaker cabinets placed directly behind the screen, to create the world's largest 3D beamforming audio system. Multiple audio streams can be delivered directly to individual seats simultaneously, while an infrasound haptic system will use vibrations, scents, and fans to enable guests to quite literally become part of the action in a highly stimulating experience. There are no columns or structural features of the building getting in the way, and the viewing experience is designed not just towards the stage, but in all directions. It would be a shock then to know that Sphere is actually one of the worst shapes for acoustics. This is because sound travels in all directions at same speed, and when it hits the spherical structure's walls, it bounces back and results in muddled audio that ruins the acoustic experience. This is why when you go inside traditional venues, there's still the curved boxes, which is actually the best shape for acoustics. So a building like Sphere would not be possible with traditional audio systems. So they developed a new sound system that uses audio beams to deliver sound to individual seats directly. This is done through wave field synthesis. Normal loudspeakers radiate the sound in all directions so the room determines the quality of the sound. Using wave field synthesis, sound is only directed at those listening and not at the walls or other structures. This eliminates the echo and reverberations. All speakers have a different function even though they all emit the same signal, but at different times and at different amplitudes to target different areas tens of meters away and with constant volume. 167,000 amplified loudspeaker drivers are placed around the sphere along with another 300 mobile modules. They create crisp, clean, high quality audio which sounds as if the speakers are directly in front of you rather than hundreds of feet away. Two people sitting in different sections could hear completely different things, such as different languages or instruments. This expands the possibility for truly customizable experiences. Sphere's audio system will allow sound designers to create a virtual point of origin and place it anywhere they desire. This means that audio can be directed to the listener so that it sounds close. Imagine a character whispering directly in your ear. With 167,000 speakers for roughly 17,500 seats, there's about eight and a half speakers per person, meaning the entire place is just a giant speaker system. But this is not the only innovation at work inside Sphere. You see, the exosphere contains 1.2 million LED pucks, with each puck containing 48 LEDs, and each diode capable of displaying 256 million colors. It's truly a groundbreaking building that uses advanced engineering in many areas like acoustics, construction, and display technologies. It's designed to be a VR experience that you can share with 17,000 other people, and it might be the most striking landmark on the Las Vegas skyline but I think it might be its impact on the entertainment industry that shapes its legacy.